Hey there, this is Vlad from the Insurance Sales Lab, and I'm recording this video because I know a lot of insurance agents are struggling with holding their team accountable uh, during this COVID-19 crisis where all of their team members are working from home. So what I'd like to do in this video is show you how you can hold your team accountable to still produce great results by installing a very systematic accountability process in your agency. So let's just jump right into it. What you need to first and foremost establish is uh, video conference calls, where twice a day you hop on a video call, not just a phone call, but a video call where everybody can see each other and go over several things that we're going to discuss in just a moment. Now, the platform that you can use is called zoom.us. It's a free video conference platform that you can use from your mobile device or from your computer. Now, um, the reason doing video calls is what I suggest is because it forces everybody to be a lot more engaged into the con in the conversation versus uh, just being on the phone. So video calls is an absolute must. Do not just rely on phone calls. So that's the first thing. And you have these, what I call daily huddles. There's a morning huddle and an afternoon huddle. You have to have them twice a day. So here's what you do in the morning huddle. You would want to start this about 15, 20, 20 minutes before you open your office. So if 9 a.m. is when you start accepting phone calls, when your office normally opens, then start your morning huddle at 8.40 or 8.45, and it has to be the same time every single morning. And during that 20 minute morning huddle session, you do two things. The first thing you do is you role play the sales conversation. So you would want to role play scripts such as, um, hey, I'm too busy, give me a call back later, or your quote sounds great, but let me think about it and get back to you, or I need to talk to my spouse before I can move forward with your quotes that you gave me. So if you don't already have this script, the six step script to the one call close, I'll include a link right below this video. Make sure you are using this script when you're making phone calls. But this is the script that I would suggest that you role play with your team uh, during your morning huddle video conference sessions. So that's the first thing that you want to do. The second thing is you can go over any announcements that you have for the team. And if you do that every single morning, you're going to build a culture of uh, not just accountability, but a culture where all of you guys are striving to get better day after your day because you're role playing sales conversations every single morning. Now, secondly, during your afternoon huddle, you would want to review your daily domination tracker and I'll include this in a link right below this video. But essentially what this will do is give you as a agency owner an overview of what's happening in the day of each one of your team members. So here they would document every prospect that they spoke with, whether they quoted them or not, whether they asked for the sale or not, and if they wrote the, the new household or if they didn't. So whether they are sales team members or service team members, or if they do both sales and service, this daily domination tracker will work. If you download this, uh, then I'll give you a video overview on how to best utilize this tool. But the bottom line is this, that when you do these morning sessions and video sessions, morning sessions and afternoon uh, video sessions, you'll have a good sense of what's happening uh, with your staff. And if possible, I suggest that you don't just go off of what your team members said and what they wrote down on their daily domination tracker, but pull an actual call report from your phone system. In fact, earlier this morning, I had a call with one of my clients. He's an agent out in Utah. And one of his team members who, who worked supposedly all of last week, um, turned out that he only called a total of like 45 people throughout the entire week, Monday through Friday. He didn't have any service calls that he was supposed to take. He made 45 phone calls. His total time on the phone was less than two hours during the course of the entire 40 hour work week. That is just mind boggling. 
And if the agent just went off of what the team member said, then he would have never known the true reality of what the team member was doing. The team member just wasn't working all day like he said he was. So it's imperative that you as the agency owner print the call log every single day at the end of the day and review it with your team at the end of the day. Tell them how many phone calls they made and then the team members can tell you how many times they asked for the sale and how many new households they wrote. Now, if you want any clarity on how to best implement this in your agency, feel free to reach out to me. I'll include my contact information at the bottom of this video. A couple of things I want to leave you with. First is that activity does not equal productivity. Just because you're busy, you're doing things, doesn't mean that you're productive and that you're making progress. In fact, here's something that I want to say, and I think this is important for everybody. When you have these morning huddles and afternoon huddles, there's one specific word that I want you to absolutely avoid. Never say this during your video calls. Never show up to a call and say, I was busy. Everybody's busy. And we don't care if you're busy. The question is, were you productive? And there's, there are a couple of ways that you can measure whether you were productive or not. If you're someone who's in charge of acquiring new clients for your agency, if you're a sales producer, then your job is very simple. Pick up the phone, start dialing, and get to the end of the conversation where you ask for the sale. And you wanna do that four times a day. You wanna find a minimum of four new people that you, that you talk to on a daily basis who you get to the end of the call and ask for the sale. And if you're not doing that, then you're wasting your agent's money. They shouldn't be paying you to work in the agency if you're not on the phone and calling prospects. So I don't wanna come across rude or harsh. Uh, this is not intended to micromanage your team. This is intended to provide clarity for the team members and the agency owner and help everybody understand how everything's going. Normally, when things are, are, are normal and everybody's working in an office, you can kind of tell what's happening. But when everybody's working from their, from their home, it makes things so much more complicated. The cool thing is that these things don't have to go away once this whole COVID-19 crisis goes away. When you go back into working in your agency, you, get, you should still have your morning huddles and you should still have your afternoon huddle, but you'll do it in person. But for the time being, whether it takes one, two or three months to get everything back to normal where people can go back and work out of their office, I highly suggest that you do these video calls twice a day. And if you have any questions on how to best implement that in your day to day, feel free to reach out to me. Um, and as far as this daily domination tracker, I'll include a link below this video. Make sure you download that. With that, I want to wish you the best and reach out to me if you have any questions about um, how to hold your team members accountable. And if you don't have this sales script already, if you're not using the sales script, make sure you get access to that as well. Take care.